I recently heard a phrase which says, from a garden to a city with a cross in between. It reminds us of where mankind started, and that was the Garden of Eden, and where redeemed mankind will be in eternity, and that is the New Jerusalem, the eternal capital city of the New Earth. The Garden of Eden was where it all began for mankind. Genesis chapters 1 and 2 says that God created everything perfect and he plainly stated his will to Adam. Do not eat of the fruit of the tree of good and evil. And this was the only thing that was off limits to Adam and Eve in this wonderful garden. But then the serpent came and tempted Adam and Eve to rebel against God by eating the fruit. And so they ate and everything began to unravel from there. But God also told the serpent how Satan would be defeated, that his head would be crushed, and that one day a human male child born of a woman would rise up and defeat him. And so Satan made every attempt to destroy and corrupt the bloodline of Adam, but he failed dramatically. And after Jesus died on the cross and rose again, Satan knew then that his days would be numbered. So he continues to make every attempt to stop mankind from becoming believers in Jesus. But we know the end of this story. We know that as believers in Jesus, our future is secure. Revelation tells us that there will be a new heaven and a new earth. And on this new earth, there will be a new Jerusalem, a new city, the eternal capital city of the new earth. Its dimensions are going to be 1,380 miles in each direction, which scholars say is slightly smaller than our moon. Friends, the end times are closing in, but we know that our destination is heaven. We know that there will be a time when we will be in this new earth, we will be in this new heaven. So keep on, keep pressing forward, keep your eyes fixed on the cross. The world behind us, the cross before us. Keep on journeying forward, my friends. Amen.